Okay, Shalom. Uh, first off, I want to say all praise to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Uh, double honors to the apostles and elders of GMS. And Shalom to the elect out there, pushing the word in sincerity and in truth. All right, so this is uh, GMS precepts where we make up precepts together. All right, and the topic I'm going to touch on today is um, the name. Okay, the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. I was going to be brought back to our our re re remembrance, all right? Because you got groups out there where it's really IUIC and other dumb groups that say, "Oh, we don't know the name." All right, you got Nate Nate Snaking and friends. They 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 basically glory or they boast in their ignorance of not knowing a name. All right, they they boastfully say, "Well, we don't know the name." All right, but according to the scripture, all things are going to be brought back to our, our our remembrance, and one of those things uh, is the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. All right, so I'm gonna just get right into the scriptures. First one I'm gonna get into is in uh, Saint John, <coughs> um, fourteen, verse twenty-six, and it reads, "But the Comforter, which is the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name." Well, yeah, well, right there, the comfort is what? The comforter is, is the scriptures, okay? All right? Which the Holy Spirit says, whom the Father will send in my name, okay? There goes that name again, right? And it says, and he shall teach you all things and bring all things to your remembrance whatsoever I s said unto you. And one of those things that's going to be brought into our remembrance, well, to name a few, is us knowing that, our know us knowing our true identity as Hebrew Israelites, um, what tribe are from, okay, whether you're um, a Levi, whether you're from the tribe of Levi, tribe of Judah, tribe of Ephraim, tribe of Manasseh, okay, <coughs> knowing uh, the, the true color of the Lord and his son, okay, knowing the, the uh, knowing who, who the devil is on, on, on this planet earth, who is a so-called white man, known as Esau in the Bible, all those things are going to be brought back to our, 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 our remembrance. And one of those things is the name, okay, which is Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. That's one of the things that's going to, you see, the thing that these other, the, the people that say that, like, for, uh, in particular, Nate's group, they really don't, if, if you're saying you don't know the name, but yet they call themselves, oh, yeah, I'm from the tribe of Judah, all right? When you break down the word Judah, Okay, that's that's why that's why they say that's why they just make that blanket statement of oh you, we we just don't you you don't have to learn the Hebrew because if you do learn the Hebrew and the Lord is dealing with you you'll realize that <laughs> the Lord name the Lord's name is Yahweh and the uh, the Most High's name is Yahweh and the Lord's name is Yahweh Shai because look at the word Judah it it's it's in the in the Hebrew it's Yahweh which is the most high praise or most high thanks okay you got yahweh and then you got the the is short for the water and the 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 and, and yahweh okay yahweh the yahweh thanks <coughs> but these dummies won't go into that all right so all right now key word here is 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 re re remembrance right okay next scripture i'm gonna get into is in peter's Second Peter three one it says this second epistle beloved I now write unto you in both which I stir up your pure, pure minds by way of remembrance, okay. So one of the things that we're gonna learn, uh, in 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 this time in in the latter days is you know so, some of the things that I mentioned like um um uh, the identity of the so called white man, all right him him going into slavery us being uh uh. That special seed that was talked about in Abraham, where all the promises were, were were given to, all right, and the name, the name is one of the things that we're gonna be, um, that's that's gonna be given back to us in in, in the latter days. All right, the next scripture I'm gonna prove that in is in Baruch. <coughs> this is Baruch, the second chapter, and it says. And they shall praise me in the land of their captivity and think upon my name. There goes that name again. We're in captivity right now. Okay. 
and how and what's way, what, what's a way to praise the Lord? You praise his you praise the Lord by saying his name. All right. Now, one would say, oh, if they read this, oh, well, this happened already. All right. Well, read on. Let's read on and see what 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 when this is supposed to happen or if it happened already. And it says and it reads and re I read it again. It says, and they shall praise me in the land of the captivity and think upon my name. And return from their stiff neck and from their wicked deeds, for they shall remember the way of their fathers which sinned before the Lord. Now there's a key right here. It says, And I will bring them and I will bring them again into the land which I promised with an oath unto their fathers, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Alright, and th and they shall be lords of it. And I will and I will increase them, and they shall not be diminished. So this is obviously talking about uh the, the, the kingdom of heaven. This 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 prophecy didn't take place yet. Okay? And it continues on to say, And I will make an everlasting covenant with them to, to be their power, and they shall be my people. And I will no more drive my people of Israel out of the land that I have given them. So that's obviously talking about the kingdom of heaven. So this this verse right here, when it says, I will, They will praise me in the land of, the, of their captivity. That's the last captivity that, that's, that it's talking about, which is right now under the hand of the so-called white man who's known who's known as Esau in the Bible. So we do know the name, okay? And the name was given to us by the comforter, which is the scriptures. All right? So that's that. We do know the name of the Lord. D d don't let no stupid camp a, a stupid nigga uh make you think otherwise, okay? Alright, so with that, Shalom until the next show. Shalom.